What's up everybody? Dustin from My Freedom Smokes here today. I'm gonna talk about this new pretty cool sub-ohming tank, the Dicey Saint. I like this thing a lot. Big flavor chaser, I'm not a cloud chaser, but as you can see, decent clouds from this thing. Tons of flavor. I'm a big fan of flavor, so I'm definitely a big fan of this tank. The way I could describe the way the flavor tastes and the way the, you know, the draw, the air, the pull uh, with the airflow of this thing, imagine if the Nautilus was a sub-ohm tank. So it's that kind of experience. It's a, it's a tighter draw, it's not as wide open, but the flavor you're gonna get from this thing is intense. I'm using kind of a wide bore drip tip, just to show it off, because I'm a big fan of this drip tip and it goes well with this whole thing, being vain about it. But I have another drip tip that I actually prefer to use on this. It's a tinier drip tip, kind of a thinner, like a bore, uh, so the flavor is more concentrated. I have a really good experience with that. Great experience with this, but better with that thin. It feels like, or it tastes like, the flavor is more concentrated in one area of my mouth, which might not make any sense scientifically, but I do notice a substantial difference with a tighter draw uh, drip tip when I'm using this thing. It's a four mil tank and its design is super tiny. and I'm a big fan of that. I really like how tiny it is. I've been really trying to put together a nice stealth vape setup, or not really something to hide vaping, but something that's really lightweight and tiny to carry like on a, you know, one of these Eclipse or something like that. This tank really helps me with that. So I'm trying to find me a new tinier box mod to accompany this thing and maybe get a smaller drip tip. And this is gonna be a pretty sweet setup. So that's really one of the biggest reasons why I like this is the size. So with it being only four mils, it doesn't hold a lot of liquid and you will be changing it. But the simplicity of changing the e-liquid in this thing, it, it's, it's way easier than most tanks. It's not a top fill or anything convenient like that. It's still a bottom fill. But when you unscrew the thing and you take it apart and you look at where the holes where you put it in, it's just a series of like, I think 10 holes, nine holes drilled around the base. So it's basically just a, a net there that you just poured or dripped the e-liquid into to fill it up. Very simple. You can't even make a mess because basically if it does, you know, you get it on the side, it just drips down one of the other holes. It's really, really, really simple. Pre-installed out of the box, it has a 1.5 ohm coil. It comes with a 0.5 ohm also, which is what I'm using. <clears throat> I'm getting great flavor from both. When we got this sample in to review, I use this thing so much that I burnt through both of the coils and had to wait until we got more coils just to do this review video because I love this thing so much. Got to remember not to do that in the future. Got to kind of, you know, vape sparingly. It's made from 304 stainless steel and Pyrex, which means you don't want to drop it, but I throw a vape band on mine. Everything else about this thing, it's very surgical, nice. You're not going to strip the threads. Everything just works very well. Just don't drop it, the, which is the, you know, the, the Achilles heel of all glass tanks so far, in my opinion. So we start using that heavy duty bulletproof glass tanks that we're going to have in 10 years. A very good experience was the thing. Uh, never heard of the brand it came from. But when I, you know, so I was kind of iffy. I get a lot of tanks that I've never heard of and I try them and they're just, but you know, out of the last 10 I've tried, this one has shined the best. So I would definitely give this a try if you're looking for a stealth vape setup or if you're a flavor chaser like me who doesn't really depend on clouds or really care about clouds and you just want more flavor, this is definitely your go-to tank right now. Tiny, just petite, small, really simple, easy to fill. This is more for the hobby level vapors. There's someone who, uh, knows what they want from vaping, it's definitely flavor. This is a very niche thing. I'm a big fan of it. it. It definitely scratches the itch that I have in vaping. So definitely gets my seal of approval above most tanks out right now. Give it a try. So as always, this is Dustin from My Freedom Smokes. Thank you for vaping.